Hey, Matt Pouliot here at 418 and 424 Western Avenue, introducing these properties that are going on the market for the first time in nearly three decades. These two properties are combined together for one price of 1.45 million. And the cool thing about this location is that it has a tremendous amount of traffic count, uh, nearly 22,000 vehicles a day going by, bringing great exposure to these properties. This particular building at 418 Western Avenue has three tenants. You've got the barber shop on the front. They've been here for a while. They want to stay here. They love this location. In the middle section of the building, there is actually a vacancy right now, a recent vacancy. Pre previously was used as a medical marijuana location, uh, but there's a multitude of uses available for this building. And then Kyocera, which is a copier business, is located in here as well. Shifting over to 424 Western Avenue, we have a 10,000 square foot building with just about 5,500 square feet currently finished and about 4,500 square feet or so currently unfinished. This has been used for a long time as an auto parts store uh, and previous to that was used as a marine retail type business. So the front section of the building actually has the ability to be have the floor taken out. It's not structural whatsoever and have two levels uh, to offer additional showroom space if you're interested. So a lot of options here at 424 Western Avenue. The current tenant's gonna be moving out soon and the space will be vacant and ready for a new user. The owners of this property have really gone to great lengths over their ownership period to take really good care of the property. Uh, just recently, they put a newer roof on 424 Western Avenue and had the building completely repainted. In 2022, the parking lot was completely re resurfaced and redone to provide for better drainage and better accessibility to the property. This property is being offered combined together with both lots at 418 and 424 Western Avenue for a combined acreage of 2.45 acres. With over 200 feet of frontage, this also gives a good opportunity for additional expansion of development in the back of the property. 418 Western Avenue currently has one vacant space, which is over half the square footage of the building. With that rented, it could be expected that 418 Western Avenue would bring in over $4,500 a month total. 424 Western Avenue has been rented to a long-term tenant that is going to be vacating soon. So while the current rent at $5,000 a month is reflected in the income and expense information for the property, it could be expected that this space would generate a lot more with a new tenant. That combined with the income from 418 and current expenses of only about $32,000 a year for taxes, insurance, ground maintenance, utilities, including heat for 418 Western Avenue, means that both of these properties could generate a net operating income of closer to $110,000 a year if fully rented out. The site is actually zoned CC Regional Business, which allows for many uses, including business and professional offices and services, small distilleries, breweries and bakeries, auto repair, sales, and more. Uh, just a whole host of options here with these properties. Make sure to reach out and connect with us if the use that you want has not been listed here because there are others available, and there's a good chance that what you want to do in this space can go here. Coming into 418 Western Avenue, you are greeted with a vestibule area which has entrance to the barbershop that's been here for years. They love being in this location and they intend to stay. And then there is access to the vacant space in 418 Western Avenue through this vestibule as well. Um, there's actually kind of two doors to get into the space. There's a door directly here to the right. So if you wanted to rent this little space to a tenant of their own, they would have their own entrance. And then as you head back through the vestibule, there's additional access to the rest of the space. This is where you'll find a small little break room utility area and also a full handicap accessible bathroom that is right here uh, as part of this space. But the way that this is configured, you could also take this and turn it into common space so that if you wanted more of a shared office environment in the area that I'm going to show to you, uh, the people who are renting could come out and use the bathroom and the break room space here on their own. So there's kind of really good flexibility with this space. You could rent it to just one tenant, uh, or you could potentially split it up and rent it to multiple tenants that would have access to this common space out here with the bathroom and the break room. 
So headed down the hall from this uh, common space, you have three private offices. They're all 12 by 12 and a half, so good size offices with windows that look out over the front of the uh, parking lot area. And then getting down to the end of the hallway, there's also additional storage space. Now at the end of the hall, there is kind of an option with what you might want to do with the space because on the back side, the two rooms that are here are a lot larger and more open. So on the front part of the building, you have those three private offices. In the back, this was previously used as more of a retail space. It was a medical marijuana caregiver um, location. And so people would come in and then the, the product that they would buy was back here. And so that is a potential use again, maybe for the space, but also if someone wanted to do a different type of retail, or maybe needed more open uh, space for office, cubicles and whatnot, uh, or just storage, then there is that here as well. So this is kind of a good setup if someone were looking to put in a shared office arrangement because you could also turn these in to conference rooms. So a lot of options here for uh, additional use of this space and a lot of flexibility because you do have access on both sides of the property where you have the vestibule coming in on the front side, this space also has kind of an emergency exit door that goes out to the backyard. So there does exist, you know, egress and a little bit more flexibility for use of this space here as well. So great opportunity here at 418 Western Avenue to repurpose the center section of this building, about 2,200 square feet available for multiple uses. It's been my pleasure to introduce you to 418 and 424 Western Avenue here in Augusta, offered at 1.45 million. This is a great opportunity to get your business in front of 22,000 vehicles a day. If you're interested in this property, call Pouliot Real Estate at 248-6044.